welcome back <laughs> I am doing this intro in a different location but all will make sense towards the end of the video um, in this video we've got a little bit of work to do on the E46 it's also Kevin's birthday uh, I get my RS5 back from the paint shop uh, gets a new exhaust and we get the Lamborghini ready for a holiday so let's go Saturday sun's out and I've got the great job of cleaning the parts for the E46. I just want to show you how bad this under tray is and it's going to be so satisfying to clean. <laughs> okay this is how bad it is. I don't think I've seen anything like this before. This is going to be, I can't even get, oh my god that is how thick it is. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Let's clean it. <laughs> came off that under tray. That is so disgusting and that took me ages. I've just sprayed some iron off on it uh, and then I'm gonna jet wash it down and hopefully that helps. I went to pressure wash it and Matt had already done it but at least it's done now and it's nice and shiny clean. I can't believe what it looked like before but all ready to go back on the car. Another job done today was put the tyres on the alloys for the M3. Uh, hopefully they'll go on today. Matt is still working on the car. And they're on. This car is really coming together now. It actually looks like a decent car. <laughs> new t-shirt. Oh, new t-shirt. Link in know. description. Oh, the lenses. Oh, new lenses. They look sweet. New grill, new badge. The front end is looking sick. I think it needs a splitter now. That's not original. Yeah, I know, but a CSL one. CSL, like the wheels. Yeah, it'd look good if you're not restoring it. Mm. A lot of you in the last video wanted to actually see all the paint damage, or most of the paint damage. Um, this is the worst bit, I think. Let me show you. So here, we've got a lot of lack of peel. It does not look very nice. This is the worst bit of the paintwork, to be fair. We just need that touching up and some other little areas. The one thing to come off the M3 is these tyres and alloys. So if anyone wants them, just give me a shout. Absolutely loving the look of this now, but there is space in the ramp and for a very good reason. We're gonna put the Lambo here and as a lot of you have requested, we are gonna put the bumper on. No, it's not because, not because I'm giving in, because we need to, because of the Spanish authority. I don't know. I haven't even said where we're going yet. Yeah, well, there you go, please. Yes, it's exhaust. <laughs> okay, while Matt's getting on with that, I am gonna clean these wheels because, oh my God, they are filthy. Let's get some spray on them. I'm not gonna do the other side because it's a lot easier to clean the front side of the wheels when they're on the car. Uh, yeah, I'll leave that bit up to Matt. Now, because I won't be doing any of the work and Matt will be filming it for his channel, I'm just gonna click and it's gonna be done. Okay, I had to pause the video right there because me and Matt have run into a bit of an issue and Matt's fuming. <laughs> I'm fuming. <laughs> do you wanna tell him? So, I had to do the C word test um, to get onto the ferry. We did it 48 hours before the test didn't come back in time for us to get on the ferry like we didn't have anything so couldn't get on so we abandoned ship literally, literally. abandoned ship <laughs> and then um went on the <laughs> we stayed in a hotel last night and the night before we thought well we'll sack it off it's came the test has came back now negative two days later after we went to go thank you <laughs> thank you so this trip is postponed until <laughs> further notice hopefully next week yeah so, thank you. I mean, thank you. So the bumper is on the Lamborghini, but I'm not going to show you until we do actually go on this trip because 
Matt would just be fuming. And the and the roof box is on, which looks. Oh sick. yeah, and the roof box is on. It's proper touring. Mode. Yeah, we have had a lot of people come up to us, recognising you, recognising me. So thanks for that if you're watching. <laughs> We're back at the unit. I think we're just going to forget about what happened over those last few days. We are going to try and go away soon, but I don't know when it's going to be. Hopefully sooner rather than later. But in better news, my car is back. So let's go have a look at it. It looks completely different and sounds completely different because obviously Matt's been tinkering with it. Let's go. And here she is, all one colour. She actually looks like a functioning car right now. It's so strange to think of how it looked just like a month ago. I do apologise for how dirty this thing is at the minute. I was supposed to be cleaning it today, but we keep going in and out of rain clouds, so... Right. <laughs> It would just be pointless, but I have been driving this. It is now my daily car, so she is going to get dirty. It's just what's going to happen. I'm sorry. I'm so in love with this car now. I, I've always been an Audi girl ever since I started getting into cars. My first proper car was obviously the Audi TT back in the day. Um, so I'm so happy to be back inside an Audi now. One other thing that Matt has done, which has completely transformed this car, the way it sounds and feels, is the exhaust. So, let's listen. How amazing does that sound now? It's just like the cherry on top of the cake for me. It needed to be done. I can't believe Audi would let a car like this leave its unit sounding as poor as it did. This is how it is supposed to sound. Sorry I didn't leave it on for very long. It hasn't got a lot of fuel and as we're in a fuel crisis at the minute, I want to save as much as we can. Are you happy with your exhaust? I'm oh, so happy. I was saying to Matt yesterday about this is how my Mustang should have sounded. Uh, it sounds like a proper V8. It sounds like a deep bellow. I wish you could hear it. Honestly. Yeah, it's a proper. I still think it needs to be louder though. Really? I think it needs a decat. Okay, go on then. I think it needs decat in and supercharging. But just give it some. Okay, okay. <laughs> no, it does sound good. It sounds nice, but we want Asbo. <laughs> I think it needs to be Asbo. It's a very special day because today it's Kevin's birthday. So we're going to go to the pet shop and I'm going to let him pick out whatever he wants. To trying to get to Spain, will we make it? Confidence is high. <laughs> Up here. I think it's not too bad. How are you getting that? Oh no. <laughs> it's the ladders. We made it further than we did last time at least, but I am gonna end the video there. In the next video we're gonna I'll show you the whole holiday, well as much as I can film while relaxing at the same time. And yeah, you'll see the rest of the video next week. So you think you're right? Bring it up, bring it up.
Don't prove me wrong Go put up a fight 